you know, big epidural patient came in blowing a pee hole, uh, you know, got to help evacuate the clot. And the next morning, patients awake and talking. And if you have any interest in a field like neurosurgery, try to scrub, you know, early on in your medical school time, try to go to your department and try to scrub into some of the neurosurgeons. I went to med school in, 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 in Baltimore, and uh, it was Shot Trauma, which is a big trauma center, probably one of the biggest in the in East Coast. And uh, it was a Friday night, and, you know, there was a, a patient who came in with an epidural hematoma, HIV positive. The chairman of the department uh, was on call, and, you know, him and I could the senior resident, they were doing the case, and they said, all right, do you want to drill the burr holes? <laughs> you don't want to touch the, you know, take the risk of touching. So I got to drill the burr holes, and, you know, big epidural patient came in blowing a pupil, uh, you know, got to help evacuate the clot, and the next morning, patients awake and talking. And that was an incredible high. You know, there's nothing else in my uh, life in medicine or you know engineering or undergrad that i've seen comparable to that i think to this day it still is it's probably the most satisfying thing you do is when you see somebody who's extremely sick and you make them better um and at that point i knew it was worth whatever the um that effort that would be required